What is going on guys? I hope you're having a great day. If you're new to this channel, my name is Peter and we're about to do some fishing today. I'm out here with my buddy Mikey. What's going on guys? Today I want to show y'all little tips and techniques how we're going to fish this pond. If you ever watched my other video, this is actually where I caught my PB 11-2 giant fish. Last time we were out here, Mikey caught what, like a four and a half? About a four and a half, five. It was a big fish. There's still a couple in here, but there's a lot of little two pounders, but this pond is super weird. It's a finesse bite. These bass literally just want all natural colors. So in this video today, I'm going to be a little super fluke. It's a good bait right here. What are you going to be doing, Mikey? Uh, green flash baby brush hog. Caught my PB on it. So we're throwing, throwing PB baits right now. But I'm going to show you all little tips about why I throw weight lists and how I get fish to bite because the bite's super hard in here. But we're going to see if we can get a couple of reaction bites. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you. All right, guys. So we're all rigged up, tied on. What I'm going to try to target first is the middle because it is super hot out here. It's got to be at least 85, 90 degrees. So I'm curious if there's going to be any fish in the middle. I just want to see if we can hit a small school out there. And if not, we'll try to start breaking in the pond as we go on throughout the day. But once again, why I'm throwing a super fluke today, guys, once again, these fish in here are super picky. They literally only want to eat a live bluegill so to try to mimic something that looks like it honestly the super fluke wins that game it is a super good bait throwing weightless y'all it just really makes this bait come alive and it makes it look like it's a real bluegill down there match the hatch as good as you can it's the bluegill pattern a lot of times guys when you're fishing in the middle where any pond is really pressured as soon as you cast that bait out i always let it sink until it hits the bottom and a lot of times you will get that reaction bite and that happens a lot when you're fishing pressure ponds like this a bass is going to do its natural thing if something drops in front of his face he's going to eat it the one thing i know about this pond where mikey is pretty much fishing right there on that side is it's pretty deep it's got to be at least seven eight foot all the way down here it's pretty shallow right now we're just in the middle of the calm i just want to see where they're at Grass at 85, it's gotta be at least 90, 95. It is hot. Oop, there's a fish. That's a good fish. Oh, dude, that's a good fish. It's gonna go by that log. Go over, oh, dude, I just came right over that log. Come here, baby. Stay down, stay down. As it was dropping. Oh, dude, that's a big old skinny fish. Dude, look at her. Look how pretty that looks in the water. Wanna grab her for me? Nice snag. Dude, that's a good one right there. Yes, sir. As she was sinking down. But I was telling y'all, I cast it out, let that bait sink one little tick, and I just felt weight. So she literally swam up to it so slow. If I would have cast it out instead of ripping that bait, this fish, she wouldn't have bit. That's a tank. All right, guys, this is the fish I just popped. Literally, I was just explaining to y'all, fishing slow is the key. Pressure ponds like this, it is hard to catch fish, just it really is. I cast it out, let that bait sink. And if I would have started ripping that bait, fishing it the way you should fish a fluke, if this fish, she wouldn't have bit. I let it sink, went to go pull it once, and I just felt dead weight. Set the hook. This is every bit of a four and a half. She could be a lot bigger. I want y'all look at that mouth. She's a, she got a pretty big mouth. She's on a little bit of a skinny side, but that's how we do it, guys. It's pretty fish. Let's get that release now. All right, guys, we're going to release now. I'm going to make sure this girl's all good. I always do this, guys. I want to talk to this fish to show y'all on the camera. To keep them out for about a minute or two, but just always make sure. This little minnow is picking at my hand. Look at that. You always make sure she gets revived. It's the way you want to do it. Big fish like this, she is super skinny, but she's going to grow a lot more. She's biting my finger. She's about to go. Yeah. There she goes. It's a long fish, dude. And she's super long. Mm -hmm. So pretty. There she goes. There goes. Once again, y'all, that fish was just calling this little zoom super fluke. It's a nice bluegill pattern. No way, it's 88 degrees. All right, guys, me and Mike here about to lose it. It is super hot. It's not 88 degrees out here. There's no freaking way. I feel like these fish are thinking the same exact thing. They want some shade. <laughs> we'll see them there. This looks pretty good in here. Every time I walk to a new spot, I always pitch right in front of me. This is a good corner right here. It's full of shade. They don't want to spook any off that are sitting over here. All right, guys, a little update. We've been fishing this little cove right here. I don't know if it was the walk down here. It's got to I mean, it's a long walk, dude. I don't know if it was that or it's freaking 200 degrees out here, but me and Mikey just hit a bad little stump. <laughs> we were sweating so bright now. I have like no energy. We're going to take a break. Don't worry. We'll hit another pond. We'll yeah. Today, we might, we might grab some of the drink because it's just, it's really bad out here right now, guys. But. 
choices I have. Um, can't wrong with Pepsi. All right, guys, we're at the new pond. First part of this video was at a pond that we stuck one good one, but the conditions were hot. We went and got a drink. We're all refreshed now. Cool down a lot, so now we have a new pond. We're gonna go to Logan's, but this pond is actually, I don't think it's pressured. Mikey fishes this a little more than I do. We've caught a few threes in here. I mean, the pond's pretty healthy. It's, it's really deep. It's a deep the, yeah, pond. this is the pond where it's 30 foot deep. I filmed the video here before, guys, so. Mm -hmm. It's gotten a lot cooler. I'm gonna throw a little Texas rig with a little trick worm. See if we can do on that. What are you gonna throw, bud? I'm starting with a weightless swim bait. See if I can get some top water or a Texas rig brush on next to chrome bait still. It's a pretty bait. We're gonna see what we can do, guys. I hope you all enjoy this video. Thank you. I don't think it's, it's, it's an aggressive pond, dude. I don't think they're gonna hit it on top. Be that deep, dude. Ooh, that's a fish. Oh, no. <laughs> Little guy. How am I gonna get you out of there? Come here, bud. I got you. This little, this little chunk right here. Little fat little thing. Oh, don't freak out. Don't freak out. You freaked out. All right, that is my sec that's, well, second fish of the day, but first fish out this pond. He's a little doobie. He's a chunk. The hook kind of hard. He bit a lot more aggressive. He was going all the way to the left with it. All right, this is going to suck, buddy. I don't want to throw you, but I got this in front of me and like five feet of muck. I want to rip your mouth. I'm going for the spiral. Bye, buddy. He'll be all right. Feel bad doing that, but I don't want him to get stuck in the grit. Like, this is what that dude put me through, and he would have got stuck in it going back. Now we're talking. This is the money right here, dude. Let's see what we can do. Ooh, that's a bite. Got it. Come here, baby. Good one. Uh, I'm so sick of this little grass. It's on my neck. Get up here. No little chunk. A little bit bigger than the first one. That is disgusting. All right, my second little fish today. Not a bad one. A little bigger than the first. I can throw you back a little bit better. Bye, buddy. Oh, that is two fish out the moss. The fish a little bit deeper so there's any chilling out there. This ain't very open. Oh, that's a fish. Oh, on the drop. Boy, she smoked me. Got him? She feel good? She ain't bad. Get her, boy. Oh, that's a good one. Get her, Mikey. I'll grab her for you. Try to get her in this path right here if you can. She's going over. Change the plans. All right. Thank you. Got her in the throat. That's a good one. Look at Mikey's fish right there, boy. There yes, sir. On the drop, too, man. All right, boy, give her a toss back. She gone. Good fish, bud. Thank you, man. Yes, sir. Make that move. You got one bait snatcher, one solid two-pounder. Second spot was a win. Let's stand up here really quick. I don't want to spook anything off. Is that a fish? It is a fish. Come here, buddy. All in those weeds. My <laughs> dude. So you break rods right here. Oh, that's a rod breaker. We got her up. I got more. I would call this lettuce, but this is like nasty slime. It's not even the green stuff. He's in there somewhere. It's disgusting, dude. Look at that. Nasty. All right, third fish for me. No little baby. Take it. Hi, buddy. All right, guys. End this video now. I hope you enjoyed it like always. Today, it was a struggle with the heat, but we pulled it off. Thank you, train. 
We pulled it all fishing this pond. We got a few good ones. It was yeah, you stuck a good fishing. one. Yeah, it got about a nice two pounder. It was a fatty. Yeah, it was. It was good fish. But all, all together, guys, we pulled it off. It was a great day. I stuck that first good one in the beginning. <clears throat> it was an awesome day. You had fun today? Good day, good day. Yes, sir. If y'all enjoyed this video, there's much more to watch. If you haven't watched my newest video, I stocked my pond, saved my little fish because they need help really bad. So we stocked the pond and there's many other videos to watch. So all y'all got to do is just click right here to watch them and just click the subscribe button down here, guys. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys. Looking Bass TV.